Long drive competition is gaining popularity in the world of golf. Using a 48 inch driver, top athletes are attaining club head speeds of 145 miles per hour, nearly 65 meters per second. On the PGA Tour, the majority of players use a driver that's 45 inches long. Recently, the driver length limit was reduced from 48 inches to 46 inches. So for today's problem, we're going to calculate the angular velocity from a swing with a 48 inch driver, producing a club head speed of 65 meters per second, and then determine how much faster you would need to swing a 45 inch club to attain the same club head speed. The club head speed is equal to the length of the driver, or radius, multiplied by the angular velocity in radians per second. Thus, angular velocity is equal to the club head speed divided by the driver length. In our first scenario, 65 meters per second club head speed with a 1.2 meter driver, or 48 inches, results in an angular velocity of 54.2 radians per second. This is 3104 degrees per second. In our second scenario, 65 meter per second club head speed with a 1.14 meter driver, or 45 inches, results in an angular velocity of 57 radians per second, or 3267 degrees per second. This is a more aggressive swing. It demands much more from the body to generate the same club head speed, which is probably why Phil Mickelson was so displeased when the PGA Tour announced the reduced driver length limit of 46 degrees.